hello and welcome back. We managed to kill some monsters uh, last time and whoa, we need a uh, key for this chest. <gasps> we don't have the key. Oh my God, we are have a, like a complete army here and there's like a chest here and we don't have the key. How would you open a wooden box without having a key? That's kind of reinforced with iron, but like, come on, really? Bash the box. Really? I don't have the key? Or, oh, maybe I'm, because I, I decided to be in an offline mode. Maybe that's it. Who knows? But I don't have the key for it. God damn it. Oh no. Vroom. These charlatans are about to begin amputation. They say I have a chance to pull through. As with such things, nothing is for certain. Especially as I awoke this morn to discover gangrene had set in. Hence the reason I write to you now. If you are reading this, it means I did not survive. First and foremost, raise a glass in my honor, then make for the trebuchets on the other side of camp. Between them, you'll find some trinkets from Rosberg. I plan to return for them myself, but it seems the great son's grace no longer shines upon me. May you emerge from this war in one piece. Zuckerberg. Okay. Sure? Uh, you really think that in wartime your letter will get where you need you intend it to, to get to? Gascon Plus! Holy fuck. That, that's what I'm talking about. I'm a little, I don't know, conflicted about seeing all these plus. Are we gonna have like Gascon Plus Plus? I kind of hope at this point. What, what happened here? No! Are we, are Sadly, they, it was Rayla who met with surprise. A hundred yard gap gaped in the unbreachable walls of Rosberg. The fortress itself was aflame, spewing black smoke into the sky. I don't... How? It can't be! There was no time to consider her question, for Nilfgaardian scouts had spotted Meave's company. The Queen knew battle was inevitable, so she gave the signal to form a defensive line, then drew her blade. These bastards even set the, the stone castle on fire. We gotta get them. Prepare the scouts from calling reinforcements. Yeah. Not that. Oh crap, what are we doing here? So... I should somehow prioritize dealing damage, right? Your Grace, no guardian fighters remain in the city. No way. So. Huh. Only increase the timer by two when you die? I don't know, man. Do we need some points? Because I'm, I'm thinking yes. Of course, as you wish, Master. I see, but our main wing condition could be that he's just gonna fill up his own board. 
and he's not gonna have anything. So I think may I may have the wrong approach here. There's a time to reap, a time to sow, and a time to die. Well, how much? I'm supposed to take him out Bloody now. Horsons. They'll pay for this. For Rivia! I think it's gonna be what... If, if he can win by just simply points alone, I think that's the reasonable way to... Uh, try to win. Because what am I really gonna do here? Lyrian Arbalest. Okay, I did that. Okay, that's strong, but if your board is full, you can't mess with me anymore. So, I think that's gotta be the strategy. Right. Is it my turn? Stop roping! You bastard! Oh, that's not good. Well, that's strong. Well, it's gonna hurt me a lot that you're gonna hit me for 10 with every single card. Obviously, they meant to make that uh, an impossible challenge. Arm is a waste of time for one like me. I'm not sure I'm supposed to do this. He has room for six more soldiers. So six more cards he can play from hand. Holy fuck, game. Would you play the card already? Oh my god. Off to the front yet again. Oh, that's smart. I think we're gonna lose. I refuse to believe it. The king could not have died here. Yeah, but the thing is, this is gonna be like 36 plus uh, not a lot. Okay, this this looks bad. Let's restart. That's, that, that's obviously not gonna help me. Well, he was, he was so annoying, because... <sighs> yeah... I don't think the Straves of Spala is gonna help me a lot. Am I going like this? I don't wanna get a Rivian Pikeman randomly. But I guess we can always restart. Fucking shit. <laughs> well, it's, this is our mooliganing plan here. Okay? No. No. What? How many I have to send back? Great. It's even no worse. Remain in the city. Without the breaking. Okay. So... We're gonna just go with like Rivian Pikemans in the front. Oh, then we... Well, but I can wait a little bit with the long sword. I just tried to kill some spotters. 
One boat's all I need. Okay. Can boost that. Oh, that's nice. If you could just randomly hit again. the guy, that would be nice. Bloody horses. They'll pay for this. Give me a time. Okay, went up quite a bit. That's nice. If you could just randomly hit the spotter, that would be pretty sweet. I don't think that's really even needed. Like it, it's going out, going pretty well. Summon reserve units. Okay, okay. So if I can. Well, the thing is, I need to move longsword first. Wow, that's really good. Random enemy nearest to self. Army's a waste of time for one like But me. I'm not sure. I'm not. I don't have a huge faith in that. What is the nearest unit? This harvest will be reaping black clad heads. Yeah, that kind of worked out. I refuse to believe it. The king could not have died here. There's a time to reap, a time to sow. Sure, time let's to boost die. the sight then. Ah! Alright. Oh, uh, seems like his timer is gonna run out. Which is nice. Oh, we can just throw gas on. <laughs> Wait, you're serious? Off to the front yet again. Strengthen everything. That kind of worked out. Okay. Hey. The matter. Sure. Oh yeah. Don't forget the boost. Okay. But yeah, Quiet. working out. Oh, he's gonna wait. How this is gonna work? He's gonna like a a full hand of reinforcements. Next turn. Oh. Oh. Actually, clicked on the wrong guy, but it doesn't matter. I like how he's surrendering. I like I leave any p prisoners. Why do people surrender the to Lillians me? The Lillians met one note of luck in this song of woe. Rosberg had fallen, yes, but the Nilfgaardians, not expecting reinforcements from the south, had stationed only a small detachment to hold it. Meave led her men to victory and retook the fortress. Or rather, what was left of it. What's ours what anyway? They did not demolish during their assault. The Nilf Guardians burnt once inside the city. Countless charred corpses of both defenders and peasants seeking shelter from the invaders lay among the blackened ruins. Some had tried to shield their children from the fire with their own bodies, to no avail. Gods be damned! The queen cried, pounding her fist against the wall. How could you not say that, narrator? Now you. You want me to take your job? Hmm? Well, this is a pretty... grim place. And I'm a little surprised that the Nail Guardians burned it down. Neve was about to give the order to move on when she caught a stifled whimper coming from a pile of rubble. Her soldiers ran to the rescue, their bare hands digging through the fiery bricks. Here! He's alive! The man they pulled from the ruins had suffered horrible burns. His face was a stew of seared flesh and pus-filled boils, and he reeked of burnt meat. Seeing Black Rayla, the poor soul staggered to his feet and lifted a shaking hand in salute. Is it you, Deadpool? Engineer, Lieutenant Xavier Lemons, reporting for duty. 
Holy shit. We need this guy in the team. Look at our facial expressions. Like, are you for real? Are you not dead already? Medic! Send for a medic! No, he's okay. He's in there. He's gonna have some hair. Le lemons! What the devil's happened? I... <clears throat> I know not. The East Tower. I led the defense. <sighs> Heating oil to Tan Nilf Guardian Heights. <clears throat> the catapult struck. The cauldron tipped. <clears throat> burst into flames. The rest, I cannot say. Well, we can imagine. The fortress fell. Reynard, what the fuck? Holy shit. I come to value your input less and less. Reynard is just thinking, hmm, I haven't said anything for like a half an hour. How about just say something stupidly obvious? Fell? Damned Scoyote. Wait, what? That was new information? Wait, what? Xavier, look for the fuck around! Also, you were, like, not knocked out as far as I know. He must have realized that... Uh, the fortress did fell. What was that? Our preparations were perfect. A month, two we could have lasted, but... Traitors were among us. Elves. Dwarves. Is it just casual racism or you're, you you uh, actually have some evidence? Planted charges on the buttresses. An explosion shook the tower. A hole gaped in the wall. Our men threw themselves in, filling the breach. Well, that's not very efficient. Vermin. Filthy, rotten vermin. I know you suffer, soldier. But Queen Meave wishes to meet with your sovereign, Demavend. We must know what's become of him. Okay, but he probably doesn't know a damn thing. Gone, luckily. He oversaw the preparations and then returned to Aldersburg. Two, three days past. All right. The king chickened out. Then let us do the same. Reynard, prepare our departure. Hold your grace. Did... Did anyone survive? Anyone at all? Well, that depends on whether you count yourself anyone. Well, you are free to just look around the city. Um, you may not want to do that, though. Oh, yeah. Let's keep the hope alive. May have taken prisoners. The North Guardians might have taken prisoners. There's hope. How could they? An entire detachment? An entire city? The animals. Soldier, my medics will tend to you as best they can. Then we can escort you home, if... What home? This is my home, your grace. Rosberg. How convenient! Then you can stay! And the good news is... Everything is yours now. Look at that. The inn, like, behind you... All you, all you can drink. The whorehouse next to it? I, I hear it, like... Well, it's on fire. Not sure if you're into that, but like, come on, Xavier, you can just have whatever you want. What, like, just, just pick any house, you can live in that. Remember that, like, greasy, uh, fat, uh, uh, greedy, whatever merchant you, you, you know, and like, uh, you hate? But guess what? He's dead! He burned Chris with his children and wife and whatnot in his home, and you can just go there and drink a beer. Uh, in his house. How about that, Xavier? Doesn't that sound great? You can also come with us and uh, pretend not to be a bandit while we actually like, well, we're kind of doing that. And just kill people. I beg you, let me join your company. Let me exact revenge. Well, um, sure. Why not? But I have to say, you you look a little banged up. So I was I was just about well. That's why I suggested that you maybe just stay here. You know, you seem to be pretty okay with like how things are going around here. I might even wager the guess that maybe this place used to be a bit of a shithole, and now 
you know, it's... In, a, in, in some ways, at least, it's better. I respect your fighting spirit, good man. But in your state... Yeah, that's right. Uh, you're too useless. Your grace, I can hold neither shield nor sword, but I can still fight in my own way. Um, I'm an engineer. I oh. Siege towers, ballistae, bridges, whatever you wish. I pray, grant me a chance. Can you build me a siege tower that has a ballista on top? With a drawbridge? Because you, you were bragging about all three things, but... Obviously, I need to see all of it in action right away. Maybe not right away, but you know, you're gonna have like a reasonable deadline like tomorrow. So just just get a, get to it. But yeah, you're welcome. Such pain, such ferocity resounded in Xavier's rasping, distorted voice that Meave could not refuse his plea. Once the medics had bandaged his wounds, Meave's men set out towards Aldersburg, following Demavend and the Nilf Guardians. At one point in their journey, Black Raylor rode up next to Meave. The warrior's lips were a thin line, bitten to blood. Really? Black Raylor, you, you should get your uh, unhealthy, uh, addictive, self-harming behavior under control. Oh, severe. Milady. The road to Aldersburg leads through Moulderwood, where Eldane Scoyatel prowl. Same filth who killed my men, and delivered Rosberg to the Black Butchers. Rayla breathed deeply to steady her furious, shaking voice. Please, my lady, I ask you upon the holies, let us find them and destroy them. Meave gave a slight nod. It seemed the road to Aldersburg would prove long and full of challenges. Well... We kind of... Okay. I mean, I'm... Obviously, I'm not a fan of those elves and dwarves who... Assuming that story is right, but we're just gonna go with the assumption that it is. That those who betrayed Rosberg. But... We gotta... Uh, focus on the... On the objective here. And that objective is... Uh, liberating the nation. Making... Well, I becoming a queen again. Uh, taking back my boy. Killing all the people who betrayed me. And uh, making my uh, son dress more like a woman. I'm, I'm really disturbed by his uh, fashion choices, I actually, actually say. Holy crap. He needs to man up. Okay, let's see what we have. Okay. We left. Rosberg. Not too surprised about that. And now... We're probably gonna run into a bunch of uh, Squiatel... On our way to... Demo Vend. A pity Willem is not with us. Wait, Were what? to see what lies before our eyes. Caught a whiff of the burnt bodies. Perhaps he would see with whom he now consorts. Whom he allowed in our home with nary a fight. If it be your majesty's wish, I shall send a rider to the prince with her. I wish nothing of the sort. I will not correspond with the enemy. Same ride. I was just about to, well... That, I like that uh, <laughs> way of thinking. Fuck Willem. Okay. Oh, we're gonna have like a nice chat here, aren't we? Reach the walls, traitors. Where's the king? Why do you leave us a black clad mercy? Well, I don't know. He's a coward. Am I allowed to see that? It's probably a smart idea that he ran away. As much as I think that's a pussy move, I think it's a smart move. Uh, not only for himself, but I think the last thing that uh, the region needs is uh, getting de destabilized by losing its ruler. Oh my god, puzzle. Flipping square tail. Anyway, guys, uh, that's it for now. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.